much fanfare here is John Jones back in defense of his UFC Heavyweight Championship. Remarkable the manner in which he came back from a three-year layoff. Figures to present an even better version here today. Well, so many people questioned or wondered when John Jones would come to heavyweight. When he did, he looked better than he ever has inside the UFC's octagon. Winning the heavyweight championship and reasserting himself as the dominant force in mixed martial arts. John Jones once again steps into the octagon looking to build on his legacy. Now we don't know how long for this game John Jones is, so enjoy him while he is here. We'll see how it goes tonight in this UFC Heavyweight Championship title defense. John Jones, the man many of these fight fans have come out to see here tonight. sports atmosphere I cannot think of anything bigger this place is deafening as Conor McGregor makes his latest walk to the octagon every time McGregor walks through the octagon John it feels like the Super Bowl I can imagine that's the only thing that matches the energy inside an arena when the notorious one hits the curtain people love this guy people love this guy because of his ability though they love the fact that he can go out there and put a person out with one left hand they love the fact that he has shown an ability to compete at the top of the sport for a really long time. And they also love the fact that he does not apologize for being him. He is Conor McGregor. You're going to love him or you're going to hate him, but he won't change. And many have wondered aloud as to whether or not he would be back competing at the UFC, but in terms of scratching his competitive itch, there's only one proven ground in the world on which he can do it, and is the octagon. Great to see Conor McGregor. in the octagon tonight. All right, so here we go with this stand-up only fight. You guys gotta play by the rules. No grappling or wrestling of any type. Also, you cannot do follow-up strikes on the floor. Let's see who the last man standing will be tonight. Oh, beautiful jab there. It's one thing to have length, of course, it's another to use it effectively. Beautiful job with that jab. Working off the jab, it's good. Sharp hook there by Connor. Straight punch. Ooh, big shot lands. McGregor gets touched by that kick there. Oh, no building up process tonight. These fighters are crawling early. Those guys came to fight from the moment the referee said go. Oh. Nice combination. Oh, boom, the head kick there. Big right hand. Oh. Oh. Oh, the round 
roundhouse kick lands. Nice punch to the head. So just over 20 total strikes have found the mark for Conor McGregor. Oh, nice jab by Jones. Nice jab by him there. He's going nose hunting tonight, huh? Yeah, he's great with the jab. And not only as a setter, he's really just trying to get damage off every time he throws this punch. Nice right punch followed by a left. Oh, he got everything behind that kick. All right, so John Jones having his way with an opponent as we have come to expect in the octagon. He's got the long range weapon we're going to. I mean, it's the striking of Jones, his ability to set traps, his ability to make you fight his fight at his range. When you can't close the distance on Jones, you will have problems. That's exactly what's happening with his opponent tonight. He has not been able to get close enough to find success. Well, the calf kicks all the rage, but he's not discriminating, attacking the thigh pretty effectively. Yeah, we have seen that time and time. Oh, he's hurt bad. He's hurt bad, John. He's got to press him. He's got to go chase that finish down now. Timely defense there. Huge block for him. Oh, big knee to the body. How'd he get that one home? Oh, nice start. All right, there's the horn. How about that round? He got him badly there early on. You thought that maybe that was going to be the beginning of the end. At the very least here, got to think he's going to try to get him out of here in this next round. J.A., he's on skates. Yeah. I mean, he was on skates. His ability to withstand that avalanche is commendable, but he has to change something as he approaches the next round. All right, so there's the horn signifying the end of the round. A stunner there with the head strike midway through. Nearly got him out of there for good. Almost got him out of there. He hurt him badly. He had his opponent hurt real bad. Now his opponent's walking back to his corner. Everybody looks confused. They don't know what they're supposed to do to try to change the way that this fight is going. All right, round two. Conor McGregor gets caught by the inside leg kick. A few more, and that'll leave a mark. Well, without much resistance, he continues to find a home for that jab, much like he did in the previous round. How's his opponent still standing? I mean, I have no idea. This fight is supposed to be over. And it might not be over now, but it's gonna be over very soon. All right, well, good news is he rocked him. Bad news is he wasn't able to finish the job, and now his opponent's back in the fight. I mean, you don't get those opportunities very often. You got to take full advantage of them when they're presented to you. Fifty-one total strikes have landed for John Jones, and landing with fifty-three percent accuracy tonight against Conor McGregor. Just over three minutes to go. Went for the inside leg kick. Oh, man, that couldn't have felt good. Flush knee lands to the body by the taller fight. Oh, they're trading huge shots here. We'll see who's the last man standing. So a much different approach for him here in this second round. He was a little bit tentative in round one, a little bit of a feeling out process. Now, oh, he's hurt bad. Inches right there, boy. Wow. It was a good night if that landed. Oh, high amplitude head kick. Oh, my goodness. All right, so he lands again, just like we saw in the last round, realizing a lot of success with his Muay Thai game You know, why change it? It's working, and it's working from the very start. Oh, thunderous leg kick rounds his opponent. Lifted a little bit, trying to stay upright. But, man, that changed the complexion of this fight. John, he's hurt. He's hurt really badly by that one big leg kick. Jones has got a bruise appearing on that left side right now. You've got to think that body investment is going to pay dividends later. Ooh, side kick. Well timed there. 
Tried to set up the straight left, but he missed. Oh, how good is that jab by Jones? Oh, McGregor's nose is bleeding now. Yes, looks as though he got cut by one of those offerings from his opponent. Good run. All right, so there's the end of the round. Big story in this one now. The cut on the bridge of that nose from that strike. The cut man is in there. Should be able to shut this one and potentially prevent it from being a factor here moving forward. Well, if you're the replay guy, a lot to like in that previous round. A lot of damage being inflicted. Yeah, I mean, and look at the swelling now, John. He wasn't doing what he needed to do to move his head, and he's paying for it. You cannot allow for an elite-level mixed martial artist to connect at that rate and think that you will not be wearing the damage. He's wearing it now. I'm interested to see what changes he makes to give himself an opportunity. You ready to fight? Ready. Third round underway. All right, next round is now underway. I thought there was pretty good back and forth action in the previous round. Yes, it wasn't a far fight. It wasn't two guys going to kick the sink at each other. But you did see times where they came together and you saw the skill level of these two fighters. Looking for that left hand, not there. Oh, McGregor's blocking pretty well now, so an adjustment made by the fighter to protect that already significantly damaged nose. Oh, you land, I land, is that what we're doing here? Chip, look at that redness underneath his elbow. A lot of those strikes to the body starting to pile up. Getting beat up. And beat up. Oh, he's in a world of trouble now. Big right hand there. Jones gets caught by that straight punch there. Well, pretty good effort so far, DC. 87 total strikes have landed for Johnny Bones Jones. And striking with 48% accuracy tonight thus far against Conor McGregor. Well, if these were calf kicks, this fight would likely already be over, but I would say it's pretty critical with the thigh damage at this stage of the fight. Oh, and there's another place to put this out. John Jones with a huge win tonight! Jeez Louise! We set it inside the octagon for the official decision. Here is Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Herb Dean has called a stop to this contest at two minutes, 40 seconds of the third round. Declaring the winner by knockout, John Bones Jones! All right, what a knockout for John Jones. Perhaps a bonus winning effort for him here tonight. Competitive matchup, at least on paper, but didn't play out that way tonight, DC. Well, Jones has shown and proved once again why he's so highly regarded in the history of the sport of mixed martial arts. He understands.